Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609 live and in color from the free land of Texas. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. It is, uh, I'm near uh, Lano, Texas in an ungated community called an RV park. And it ain't all bad. I like it. But anyway, still alive in my 2021 Class C motorhome, a Thor 4 Winds 22E. Muy bueno. Anyway, long time, full time RVer. And guess what? Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after tomorrow, day before yesterday, or it's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow. I got it. Anyway, I'm here. I'm here. Anyway, it is a Friday morning, and today I'm going to test towing my Sparky or my Chevy Spark with my motorhome, see if I got everything working. Uh, that's assuming, and assumption is the mother of all mistakes, but assuming that we don't get any rain. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Lano, Texas? The temperature in Lano right now is 66 degrees. With a, oh, it's a 20% chance of rain. It showed higher yesterday. With a high of 79, that's good. But anyway, uh, hey Google, what's the temperature in Fairbanks, Alaska? The temperature in Fairbanks right now is minus 20 degrees. Oh my God, minus 20. Jeez, with a low of minus 25. Wow, thought it was getting warmer. Anyway, this is Thor and Thang and... <laughs> And, uh, uh, no, this is a smoky bear, Thang and Thor. Thang and Thor. Th, th, th. Anyway, get that out. So what do we got here? Uh, I got to do a, a, a quote button and a joke. Hey, Google, tell us a joke. Why did the baker become a thief? Because he needed the dough. Mm, mm, mm. A man walks into a clock repair shop and the repairman is German and says, So, what seems to be the problem? The man says, It's, it's my grandfather's clock. It doesn't go tick-tock, tick-tock anymore. Now it just goes tick, tick, tick. The repairman replies, Hmm, I think I can fix this. Let me look inside. We have ways of making you talk. Okay, moving right along. Success is not the key to happiness. Happiness is the key to success. If you love what you are doing, you will be successful. Albert Schweitzer. Albert Schweitzer. He's Irish. <laughs> ha ha. Anyway, moving right along here. We have an interesting comment from Terry George. He says, and, and it's, it's interesting. Terry George says, this is on the safety tip, the, the uh, DOT reflective tape on my Chevy Spark, should have been on the metal parts. There are no metal parts. That crap is going to be a pain in the butt to remove in the future on the plastic parts. Terry, my good friend, it's my car. Don't, why are you so worried about it? Is that kind of a new thing? It seems like people do that more. At least the comments do show that. But anyway, Terry, you're fine. Back on the meds. Enjoy your life. It's my car. Abdul, Abdullah Radi. It's a carpenter. That's on the bumblebee. There was a bumblebee that crashed on you know, my patio way back when. And he said it's a carpenter. Okay. This is Beverly. Joy Nicole on Go Fly a Kite. I ordered me a kite. <laughs> I just couldn't resist it. Doris Day sang that song. You're right. Case. <laughs> Case it I said I. Anyway, just thought I'd get you stirred up. Anyway, Boondocking with Dennis says, Good morning. Binge watching. You're getting close to 5,000 videos. I actually have more than that. They, they lost about 2,000 when I lost my channel. <laughs> Yeah, I had I had over five thousand then. Uh, yeah, but yeah, they they cut off a whole mess of them, baby, whole mess of them. But anyway, thank you, Boondocking with Dennis, for watching those. Dennis has a channel, Boondocking with Dennis. Check it out. Dorian Christie, 
Memories make what we are, along with our hopes for tomorrow. All of life brings us the present gift of today. Here's to today, amigo. You got it. Today's where we are. This moment is where we are, and then it's gone. And this moment, boom, gone, 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 gone. You know what I mean? Today is March the 12th, I think, already, 2021. What happened to 2020? I don't know. James Sams, high Rusty and his rangers. Good news. Good news. Okay. Thank you. Pearl Esme, good, great idea. I need to put some on my mailbox. That's a good idea. Very good. It'll show people how to how to hit it with a beer can and stuff. <laughs> to use it for a target. Zeno on the micro travel trailer, 800 pounds. Love it, but you lost me on the price. Well, I didn't lose you. They did. Uh, about $5,000 too much, 800 pounds. I went on their website and the light, lightest I could find was 1,284 pounds dry weight. Well, I just go by what I'm told. I wasn't a salesman, okay? Anyway, Eli James, thanks for all the great comments and stay safe. And I love your RV. You're very good, Eli. And one of the things you are is consistent. And I hope you're taking the same medication every day. You seem to be quite calm. Rebel Girl 7, question. I use Amazon Prime a lot. So if I go through your channel... You, will you be able to see what I buy, or will you just get the percentage? I just get the percentage, and, and, uh, and you mean link, not channel. The link on Amazon link? No, I, I don't see anything. I just see numbers, that's all. It shows how many clicks I have, and then it shows how many dollars have been accumulated. And it's usually about, oh, anywhere from 4 to $7 a day, average. Anyway, Ethel Perry, thumbs up. CDL Lady 54, mm, good idea for any vehicle. I agree with you on the safety tape. Mike Turner, your son must really care about you. Very thoughtful. Yeah, he is a good kid or good man now. He's not a kid anymore. WTBM123, cool. Paul S., up next, flashing amber warning lights, mag mounted to the roof. Yep, that's it. That's what's coming next. You got it, Paul. How'd you know? David Lynn. Thank you for sharing, Rusty. Blessings. Thank you, David Lynn. Tony Venata, good afternoon, America. Well, good afternoon, Tony, or good morning, Tony. Andres Laredo, rest in peace, Eli Williams, the kite man. I still have your kites, brother. Well, good for you, Andres. Thank you for talking to your buddy on my channel. <laughs> Could you live in a storage building? Sure. Oh, no, that's, that's the, the video. Nathan V. says, Give me a hammer, a saw and nails, a few other things, and I can make this, make it look very nice. But it will be a home with things you need or want. Yep, you're right. A lot of people are doing that. Lola, 2747. This is uh, Alamogordo. says, I love Alamogordo. She says Alamo. That must be the short name for it for the locals. I love Alamo. It is such a small town, but it's amazing. I've lived there for about 12 years, best 12 years of my life. Well, Lola 2747, good for you. Dorian Quist Christie on the safety stuff. That is a great idea for any car, especially the black or gray paved road colors. Cars are so popular now. Definitely prevent some accidents, amigo. Well, you never know. It could help. And if it just prevents one, that's fine with me. Moose Knuckle, Rusty, why the nighttime reflectors when you said on many occasions you do not drive at night. Well, Moose Knuckle, what if I did? Or what about early in the morning or late in the evening? Or what about on a foggy day or during the rains? Leadville Gold, you should do a six-inch strip toward the outer part of the wheels just like the reflector on bicycles. That would be cool, LOL. Well, why don't you do it, Leadville Gold? Hmm? Why don't you do that? Casita go south on the safety stuff. Thought about putting it on Casita when I bought it, but I avoid driving at night. Hard for me to see at night. Me too. But that doesn't mean you're not going to be caught out. If you get up early in the morning, you know, it's dark right now. Okay? It doesn't, you know. Anyway, enough said. Republic. Get a reflective sticker for safety. Okay. I guess I, I did. I thought I did. Wayne Johnson. Good idea. And the tape is pricey too. It is pricey. <laughs> it sure is. You got it. Joe H., that tape is good for trailers and toads. Easy to see for added safety. Yes, it is. Clint Price, a great place for every car to have some is on the door flame, frame, is the door frame, so it's visible when you open at door into traffic in dark. Good idea. Do that on your car, Clint. Situated 4, 
good idea, but you'll likely never deliberately tow the spark after sunset. No, I probably won't, but early in the morning. Sometimes I do tow early in the mornings. I mean, right at daylight. Same thing. David Bricky, that reflective tape works good. Thank you, David. Wendy McGee. White is the most visible. Yeah, it's, uh, white is the most popular color on cars by far. Al Fur, thumbs up. Leanne Glazier, really funny today. Loved it. Oh, well, I'm glad, Leanne. I was serious, actually. I was dead serious. <laughs> I'm an elder. Elder, thumbs up to you. Angie, hello, Angie. Hello to you and the goat, the gold goat, and the new member of the new member, the Rata on Tom and Jerry name I cannot remember at the moment, senior moment, LOL. However, he'll, however, he'll, something about Speedy Gonzalez there, the brain freeze, haha. And you have a great day, you too, Angie. And here comes the screaming goat, stink, screaming, stinking goat from outer space. To give you a goat kiss, a stinking tch, tch, goat kiss this morning. But anyway, WTBM123, cool on comment call. Boz Rocks, comment call. Hope the goat likes the thang, the old thang. Comes the goat again to give you another stinking goat kiss. Stink, stink. I mean, kiss, kiss. Uh, you love Doris Day songs? I don't know. I've only heard one. <laughs> case I think that's the only one I've ever, ever seen. Benson Speed Shop. Hello, fellow Rangers. Hello, Bensons. Henry Miller. Rusty, go fly a kite. I am. I got one on order from Amazon. going to be here today. I don't know when I'm going to fly it. Yeah, the wind's dead calm outside now. But it's, it's uh, yeah, it was yesterday would have been a great day. You'd have to really, but you know, they have one that you don't have to run to start. That's the one I got. You just hold it in the wind and it goes up. <laughs> That's what I like. It's, called, it's like for kids and stuff, you know. Al Fur, thumbs up. It came with string, too. Cactus Jack. Hey, 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 Cactus Jack, what's happening? Let's go glamping. That's the person's name. Go fly a kite. I remember all that stuff. Remember Puri's marbles? I had a kite. I had a kite flying for a week on the farm. Must have had 500 feet of string. That's <laughs> fun, isn't it? You still don't see much of you know down here in the park. There was one, a couple or one guy with his kids flying a kite. C. Lynn. Hey, Mr. Rusty. I think the white one. Oh, that's on the uh, Kindles. Uh, hey, Mr. Rusty, I think the white one may, may may be the Kindle basic. Well, it had to be because if I bought it, you know, uh, the backlit one, 2019. Uh, yeah, it's fine. It, it's it's a good deal. Thank you for your comments, C. Lynn. B.J. Smith. Yo, Rusty, I did not play marbles, make airplanes, but you can bet your sweet bippy we pitched pennies in the restroom. Signed, Penny. <laughs> yeah, we pitched pennies and nickels. Well, pennies most of the time. Trixie R. Doris Day sang that back in the 50s. Big hit. K Sera Sera. It's a good song. The, the meaning, you know, whatever will be, will be. That's pretty powerful stuff. Marjorie Reagan. Doris Day sang K Sera Sera. My mom used to sing it. Loved this. Thank you kindly for sharing. She also loved flying kites. A lot of people did back in the day. Charles Carlton. Take good care of the goat. This is a goat kissing stinking day, man. Here comes the stinking goat from outer space to give you another stinking goat kiss. <laughs> Yeesh. If you ever raise goats, you know what I mean. The billies stink. Carbillion, your sons are good men. The acorn doesn't fall too far from the tree. I may have read this yesterday. I don't know. Uh, anyway, Scotty Thompson, cool video talk. Cool video talk. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, well, I did read some of these yesterday. Okay, I wonder why I didn't, why, why I didn't get more comments. <laughs> did I skip some? Uh, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll go to an old, old video here. I'll go to, uh, find me an old, let me go through my videos and find an old one. And I'll just read the comments on it. Let's go way down the list here if I can. Let me go to another page here. Go back here some more. Here we go. This is this will be uh, uh, the comments from uh, let's see beer thirty happy days fifty sixty. Let's see what we got here. All right. Uh, this is Rita Richardson. Cool story, and I enjoyed the fireplace, Rusty. As long as you can still open me, open a beer can, I see no problem. I hear you. The steaming bean. What an awesome beer thirty. Uh, hang in there, Rusty. It's cold in Texas. Too cold. Yeah, this is when it was cold. Uh, Richard Riddle. 
Best beer 30 yet. Remember it all. Yeah, beer 30. Yeah, we may have one of those today, as a matter of fact. I may do a mail call beer 30 because I do have a couple of pieces of mail. Anyway, Avlis says, I remember the Flintstones being sponsored by Winston Cigarettes. My English teacher used it as a teaching moment. The jingle was wrong. Winston tastes good like a cigarette should. Ought to be Winston tastes good as a cigarette should. <laughs> it isn't funny that I still remember that. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that terrible? That they were actually sponsoring kids' programs with cigarettes. But you know, hey man, it's it's a dog eat dog world and, and big fish eat little fish, so that's all I can tell you. Uh, Bob Fincher, good morning, great stories. Uh, this is Ralph P. Great to reminisce. I know for sure the music was better in my opinion. Great beer 30, yeah. Uh, let's see, this is Avlisk. He says, Pete Pardo of the Sea of Tranquility channel is doing a month of rock albums that turn 50 years old this year. Uh, he's more of a metal fan, whatever. But anyway, Pete Pardo, whoever that is. Ralph P., Hey, Rusty, nice fire without all the ashes. Yeah, I had it on that 50-inch screen up there. Uh, yeah, you and the goat travel on. Even the goat, talking about the goat back then, that's been three weeks ago. Okay, here you go, guys. But anyway, uh, what else can I tell you? Let me get back to where I was here, and uh, if I can, channel comments, content, and see what we got. Go to comments. It, it doesn't load out all the comments sometimes. I don't know why it does that. But uh, it, it skips, and then the next day they'll all be there. And uh, But be that as it may, today is the first day of the rest of your life. Hey, Google, tell us a joke. Why was the student's report card wet? It was below sea level. A week, huh? And here we go. Sorry, I don't know how to help with that. Here are other things you can try. Go away. <laughs> this is kind of funny, but I think I've already read it. It says, what's the idea of calling in sick yesterday? I was sick. You didn't look sick when I saw you at the racetrack. You should have seen me after the sixth race. Anyway, guys, from near Lano in the ungated community called an RV park, this is Rusty78609 going to do the test towing of the spark today if it doesn't rain, which apparently it's not, and I'm going to move to another spot. How about that? See, that's kind of poetic, isn't it? But you guys... Uh, enjoy your day. I'll post a video of the hooked up deal and we'll take a little drive in the class seat and see how everything goes. I'll have on the the rear camera and watching the car and hopefully it stays back there. But so from, yeah, I've already said that, from the ungated community, thumbs up guys. Carpe diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything you want anytime. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you one penny. You just click on the link, go to Amazon, buy whatever you choose, and Amazon takes care for me, care of me, care of me. How about that? Yeah, pretty simple stuff. But anyway, what else? Drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day won't hurt you. Good for you. Help you avoid gout, kidney stones. Also help you lose weight because you'll be full of water, and you will not want to eat so much as in snack. And the only way to lose weight is form the habit of eating less. That's it. I-T. What else? Uh, take deep breaths. Breathe in really deep. Hold it for a few seconds and breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress. And relieving stress does what? Lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? You bet it is. Do it several times a day. Why? Because it's good for you. And then what else? Stretch. Stretch stretch. Swivel, swivel, swivel. Walk, walk, walk. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Exercise your body once or twice a day every single day. Why? Because you'll feel better immediately and you may live longer because of that one thing. What about uh, 
Stand guard at the door of your mind. Do not let negative Nancy or negative Ned get inside of your head. This is your head, your brain, your frontal lobes, your consciousness. All those little neurons in there are forming your thoughts. Every single one. So common sense says add good ingredients. How about that? Don't watch the news. Don't watch the news. Don't watch the news. It's all negative and it's all it's from all over the world and they're trying to dump it right in your head. Okay? Don't do it. Turn it off. You know, you can go back every now and then and read the news. You don't it, I tell you what, in my, all my 75 years of living, there's nothing I've, I have missed by not wa watching the news. Not one single thing. <laughs> anyway, having said that, accentuate the positive, eliminate the negative, enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time every day. Why? Because it's your life, live it one moment at a time. And what else? Uh, at ease. Carry on. Adios. Bye-bye. Hasta luego. Vaya con Dios. Aloha until next time. So, carry on, ladies and gentlemen, and enjoy your weekend.